Can you be sexist towards men? Um, okay. This is related to our feminism conversation, but go ahead. I have a general view that, like, you, like the feminist thing, you guys know, I think like society is sexist and we have like this internalized sexist view of ourselves when you and say, that causes us when to you be, say like, so society impact. I'm saying But when you say society is sexist towards who? Towards females. It's patriarchy. In totality. It's it's not okay, it's not sexist towards females and it like it discriminates from what they can or can't do. But Okay. There is an inherent sexism Th like Inherent. weaved weaved into the thread of our existence on this planet just by the nature of our gender roles and what is expected from each of us. Wait. It's like the Christian thing, uh, but my arguments maybe that that has like some negative impact. Okay, so let's back yeah. up. And but okay, I well, okay, you, you can I say something you now. can say something sexist to a man in my opinion, but like because it's like it's like can you be racist towards a black person? Well, I mean, yes. Mean I mean, I meant a white person. person, sorry. Can you be racist towards a white person? Yes, you can be racist towards a white person, but it's not the same as the societal oppression that black people as a race have experienced and women as a gender have experienced. That's my answer. Okay. Um, so... Yes, you can be sexist towards a man. Well, when you say man, you, you're talking about an, on an individual level, but can you be sexist, more broadly speaking, towards men? Hmm. Um... I think I could meet a girl out there who could do it. Mm. You know, could, like who could, I think it would have to be a very strong girl. I don't know, this is kind of a strong weird answer. I, okay. can't, I can't wait to get into this as soon as he's done okay. going around the table. Misandry and sexism are different. I think that's a misandrist. Well, that's hold on, not there's like misandry sexist. and there's misogyny. Those are the two counter yeah. terms. Mm -hmm. And then you have sexism, which could be yeah, it could be sexist towards men, sexist towards women. Yeah. Just works on both ends. I well, I'm saying like she just hates men because I'd say sexism is more of an act taken like to discriminate against someone, versus okay. one is just a distaste. Like a misandrist is someone who just generally hates men, and someone who is sexist towards men would do things to like decrease their opportunities in the future. So you, are you saying you can be sexist towards men? <laughs> yeah. I guess, I don't know, it's a really roundabout way of answering. I think that it's hard to be sexist towards a man, and it's lots hard. of women do not do it. <laughs> it's not common for women to be sexist towards men. It's and not? You're defining well, sexism as? Um, like I said, it's inhibiting someone's progression in life. So I, I, don't, oh. mean, I don't mean like they're saying like, oh, you're hey, ugly, on, because... Back up, back up. Sexism is what now? Let's say a woman is the CEO of a company and she's interviewing a man and a woman for a job and mm -hmm. she hires the woman purely on the basis that she's a woman. I would say that's sexism. Now, misandry would be if a girl walks around and says, fuck you in every guy's face that she meets, like you're broke and you're ugly because she just hates men. That's not inhibiting their personal growth, it's just she hates men. Okay. So I'm saying it's harder to enact sexism against men in society, however, it's still possible. Whereas misandry is like way more like possible and easy. I've met a lot of misandrists. You mean because women are asking men for more shit, essentially? They're asking for more things, more stuff? No, I'm saying that you have to have power to oppress. So there, the woman would have to be in a per position of power to commit a sexist act against yeah, a man. Yeah, so that means so that it's harder. women are coming to men for more stuff. More Dick things. Big Energy donated no. two hundred dollars. So they're not going to a father for jobs, snatches his child, for loans, saving him from no. coming. No, women are going to men. The for suddenness all those of the movement That's what is I just scary. Said. So too is Andrew and other uncomfortable truths. Love is often experienced as pain. Thank you, Dig Big Energy. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, anyway, I thought that's what you just said, though. That I, aren't we saying the same thing? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Women have to do that. Women have to ask for men for more things because of historically, and like you said, like your own beliefs, you think that women should have to ask men for more things. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. But that would have nothing to do with the other thing. So even if I thought, what do you mean the other thing? Even if I thought, and it was my belief that all the things that you're saying should happen, should happen. That was what I actually believed wouldn't make your descriptive claim that it is happening true. So I don't even know why you brought that up. It means nothing. But back to your descriptive claim itself, women are going, so your definition here, that's all I'm interested in, is that um, misandry 
only can exist if you're in power over a man. No, sexism only exists if you're in power and over a man. And then misandry is just hatred towards men. Yes. Okay, so you're saying that women are not in positions to do that because they have no power over men. Yes. What about sexual power? Um, I'd say they have less, not that much sexual power over men either. Really? Can men abort your kids for you? Seems like quite the power. Actually, I don't think I would be performing my own abortion. I think a man would be performing it. Yeah, I know, but it. who has to make the <laughs> choice? Uh, me. Yeah, you yeah. get to make the choice. So when it comes to sexual power, don't women have more sexual power than men do? The they're question, made, the question was selectors. whether or not I think that men yeah, can experience Yeah, but then sexism. we got to your definition, and that's what we're going off of, is your definition of what is sexism. Yes. And you said... Oh, what sexism is, you have to be in a position of power yes. in order to perform sexism. Okay, so you're so saying... So if that's the case, women have sexual so, power, So right? if a woman aborted her baby because her husband... And her husband didn't... Or not her husband, her boyfriend or whatever didn't want her that's to... That's a huge amount of power. You think that's an act of sexism? Well, I'm, I'm saying by your definition, isn't that power? Um, yeah. Yeah, and isn't that being applied specifically to the opposite sex? But it isn't an act of sexism because it wasn't on the basis of his his gender, was it? It was that's just how she it, wanted to abort. That's the actually baby. how it was selected was on the basis of his no. sex. Yeah, because otherwise he would have a say in the abortion, wouldn't he? Well, they wouldn't have had a child because it would have been two women. No, no, no. <laughs> what I'm saying to you is is that it's selected that he's not allowed to have a decision in it based on his sex. Well, if he could become pregnant, then he could have a decision. No, that's, that's, that's a scale wait, issue. Wait, that's, that's really a strange, a strange way to go about it. So if he could become pregnant... Then it would be his personal then, choice. By, yeah. by, your, by your standard. I just want to make sure. So if it's something which is inherent, if there's some type of like inherent distinction or inherent uh, difference, then it doesn't fall in the realm of sexism. What? I was saying if it's not on the basis of someone's gender or sex, then it's not sexism. Okay, and that, but that would her be, aborting a baby is not on the basis of the opposite person's gender or sex. It's on. It's. I don't understand. It's can, just something that can is any man part make of the, the decision process. for a female to have an abortion or not? They uh, legally, I don't think so. No. Yeah. So that seems like it's highly targeted towards a single sex. Then. Yeah, but the women are the ones carrying the child. Yeah, but and why not the is men. that the relevant thing here? That they're why are the ones you having carrying sex with someone who wants abortions? Why are you having well, okay, sex that's with someone? Yeah, like, with you guys can move on. I like, think I made my wait, point pretty clear. Yeah, but the answer from everybody. Okay. All what right. was the original question even? Okay, can you be sexist towards men? This whole little argument, I don't know at this <laughs> point. I really don't know. What, well, hold on. Okay, can you be sexist towards women? I mean, yeah. Well, why is it that you can answer well, affirmatively to that question, but not to the question? Because just like how she said, like, can you be racist towards a white man? Like. Well, okay, okay, that I can get to that one later, but. But I mean, it's kind of. Fuck like it. The let's same start thing. right now. <laughs> okay, starting with you, can you be racist? We're gonna forget right where we were at, though. But okay, we'll, we'll come back. Fine. Can you be racist towards white people? You can discri yes, you can discriminate b against them based on the color of their skin. However, like the s s s there's okay. Like what's your definition of racism? Systematic disadvantages to a certain population or group based on their ethnic or national identity. Uh, okay. I don't understand what's so painful so, about that. So, so no, you can't be racist towards white people. No, I said you can be racist towards them, but it'll never be in the same like it won't be extent. as bad it, uh it's like you can commit an act of racism but it's not like uh, there's no okay okay the, are there are is there uh hmm. it's like what i was saying with sexism if the group that is perpetuating the action is not in power then it it doesn't make sense can you be um hmm. can asian be can asian people be racist towards black people <laughs> yes can black people be racist towards Asian people? Um, yes, but less so. And that's interesting, okay. Because I'd can, say that um, the black American experience is very unique, whereas Asian people who experience racism, a lot of them are immigrants be and not- Can racist towards Native Everybody's Americans? Everybody's experience yeah. is unique. Yeah, okay, yeah. I mean, Japanese Americans were in internment camps. Yeah, I'm aware, okay. yeah. <laughs> but what about that? Like, Okay, here, I'll, let's get everybody's answers. I'm saying that societal, on, da, 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 da. Okay, societally cool. yeah, there's been a group yeah, that has cool, experienced the cool, most cool, racism. Cool. Can you be racist towards white people? The most? Hold yes. on, hold on. Go In ahead. America. Go ahead, go ahead. 
Yes, you can make racist remarks. No, no, no. Can you be racist towards white people? I don't, like, I, I don't know. This is, like, something that I really, like, can't really speak on because I'm obviously just uneducated and I don't really want to put myself in that position. Well. I'm just, like. Can you be racist towards Asian people? <laughs> yes, it happens every day. Can you be racist towards black people? It happens every day. Can you be racist towards Latinos? It happens every day. Can you be racist towards Native Americans? <laughs> it happens every day. You're can asking you be racist, things that happen Can all you be the racist time. towards white people? Like, I guess, yes, in a sense, you can. You can be... Why, why are you so quick to affirmatively answer all those other questions? But when it comes to because racism I, towards white people, you're incapable of simply answering the question. Because I don't know the white experience. I don't know. Well, are you, are you Latina? Yes. Are you Asian? No. Are you black? No. Are you Native American? No. So why were you able to answer on behalf of those other races? Because it happens every day. I've seen it personally happen. What if I told you racism happened against white people every day? Would that sway you? Well, then, is the, then is I can't the deny frequency? something that's a fact. If it's happening, then how can I deny it? Okay, well, then it's happening, so you don't deny it, right? Okay, there Okay, you go. great. Okay. So can you be sexist towards men? If it's happening, yes. If it, I don't really understand that. Like, if, to if that. that's what's going on and people are being sexist towards men, then yes. If people are belittling them, then yes. But at the same time, I do agree with her statement that, like, if you are the majority, it men doesn't hit as hard. Men yes, it aren't is still. The majority. It's still sexist. It's still racist. It's still whatever it may be. But it doesn't hit as hard if you are the majority. Well, men, men and you have aren't the, power. the majority. Oh, 